In this session, we're going to look at how we can create methods in Alice. Currently, the world is selected, and I have a Create New Method button. If I click that, I would create a method for the world. If you select an object and click on the Create New Method, then you're creating a method that's a class-level method attached to the object. First thing I want to do is to actually add an object to the scene. So I'm going to click on Add Objects, and I'm in the Animal Gallery. I want this chicken because I'm going to build a method that imitates walking for this chicken. So I'm going to click Done, and I want to be sure my chicken is selected so that when I click on the Create Method button, I am creating a method attached to the chicken. So click on Create Method, and it asks for a name, and this follows the rules for naming. It can't start with a number, and I can't put any blank spaces in it. So I'm going to click OK. When I do, in the Edit panel, I get another tab for Chicken Walk. World, my first method is still there, and remember that starts by default under Events. But now I have a Chicken Walk. So I'm going to start building the code that I need to mimic the chicken walking. So I'm going to use a do together tile. And inside the do together, the first thing I want to do is select the chicken's left leg. And that's easier for me to do here in the pane. So left leg. And I want the left leg to, t leg to turn backward. So I want a left leg turn, the direction backward, and the amount, which I already have here in my list, 0.15. Then I want the chicken, not his leg, but the whole chicken, to move forward. So I'm going to drag a chicken move forward. Again, the same increment, 0.15. So that kind of mimics half of a step, and he's moving forward at the same time. His leg, though, is up in the air, so I need it to come back down. So I'm going to drag uh, a chicken left leg tile left leg turn so I get it back in the correct position I want, and it's going under the do together block so left leg turn forward 0.15 so now I have the chicken's leg moving backward and forward and at the same time the chicken is moving that it turns backward so I've kind of imitated a single step there now I can copy this block of code by right clicking and choosing make a copy it belongs underneath the chicken left leg turn forward, but then I need a copy of that one too, because the only thing I need to actually change here is I need for the leg to change. So in this block, this to do together block, I want to be sure that I am choosing the right leg, the entire right leg, and the right leg, the entire right leg, chicken uh, right leg, entire right leg. So all I've done is switch which leg is actually taking the step. So if I play this animation, I'm going to get a message telling me that I have not called the animation. The chicken walk method hasn't been called. So it gives me the screen, but it doesn't matter if I keep replaying it. Nothing's going to happen because all the code is in chicken walk, but it's never been called. So I have to go back to the world, my first method, and if I select the chicken, then here's my new method walk. And I can just drag that tile in here. And now if I play it, when the first method starts, it calls chicken walk, which executes that code. So I'm going to click play. And the chicken takes some steps. So you've seen now how to develop a method in Alice.